and thank you so much for clicking on today's video. My name is Katie if you are new here, but if you're already subscribed, thank you so much. So I realized I haven't filmed a glasses try on haul with the brand Hip Optical in a while. I love their frames. They're very affordable and cute at the same time. And they recently came out with some fun, funky and trendy frames that I just cannot wait to show you. And I do have a discount code for you. It is just Katie and you can get yourself a percentage off of your order and save yourself some money. I'm feeling super festive today with my green sweater because Christmas is right around the corner and then I just got my nails done red last night so we got the red and the green I'm feeling super festive I cannot believe Christmas is literally like a week away it just blows my mind so I thought I would add you know a little bit of holiday cheer with the red and the green and I hope that you have a very Merry Christmas this year or if you're seeing it after Christmas I hope you have a lovely 2022 and that sounds so weird to say so without further ado, let's get into trying on some super cute new frames from Hip Optical. We're starting out super funky with the first frame. I love how big and oversized they are and they have a cat eye kind of style. This is in the frame Belga and the color is called Celestial. I love that name. I think it's very pretty. So trying these frames on, they are so fun. I love the beige neutral colors because you can wear it with so many things like for instance, this green sweater and you're gonna match. And I really like how these fit on the face they're very lightweight also I apologize if it's a little reflective because I'm sitting in front of the window to try to get the best lighting so I'm trying to not get too much reflection here so you can really see what the glasses look like on I love the tortoiseshell look because it kind of has that crystallized look to it and it has the little emblem of the hip optical on both sides and it's a little bit thicker on the sides here as well as obviously up at the top but I just really like the cat eye and I really love a thicker frame I love how hip optical has really broadened their range with the funky fun frames but also still sticking to the basic style of frames you can still get next we have the same frame but it is in a darker color this is in the style belga again but the color is called Hollywood and it's kind of a light blue and darker blue a little bit of black in there and it is again in the tortoiseshell style i love the blue i think is so fun and i have blue eyes so it you know kind of matches the color scheme we got going on here and i just love how it looks like speckled because that tortoiseshell really gives that fun bold look and if you don't want to go as bright as the celestial color you can go a little bit darker if that's more tailored to your style it kind of blends in with your outfit a little bit better if you don't want it to be too stark on your face so this is also a very good option as well also i want to clarify that if you like a style of frame just wear it that is literally the key to wearing whatever you want not just glasses but any clothes in general or hats any shoes if you think that you're not going to look good in it then you're not going to look good in it so you just really have to believe that you can rock it no matter what because as long as you like it then you are going to look good in it no matter what because you truly believe you do and i just wanted to say that because yeah these frames are funky and it's not particularly a frame that i would go for but if you just believe that you look good in it and you can rock it and it doesn't matter like what anyone else thinks you just have to have that inner dialogue like hell yeah like this works i can rock this and you will literally embody that so whatever you believe inside you are going to portray on the outside so if you think a frame like this is so fun and cool and different and out of the box than what you're used to and you're like how the hell can she wear that and I can't that's literally why is because you believe that you can't you have to tell yourself you can rock whatever the hell it is that you're putting on and then you will embody that but it's literally just what you've programmed yourself to think you seriously just have to give yourself that inner dialogue of telling yourself that you can pull this off because I like it and I'm gonna wear this today so I just wanted to throw that out there if you know you kind of want to switch things up a little bit and not get a basic frame this would be your sign to start doing it rock whatever the hell it is you want so moving on we have this frame which is personally my favorite like go-to style right now it's kind of that aviator look this frame is in the style Zaro I think that's how you say it and the color is called serenata so a bit of a longer name but i overall just love how it's a bit more square it's not too oversized i would say it's like in the medium range and i just love how it's more straight across here it really is good for framing the eyebrows and i think it's a really good shape for a lot of people to wear this is in a more muted color with the creams in the blacks again in the tortoiseshell style which is my favorite i like to add a little bit of dimension versus just something so flat and I love that this frame adds that nice retro vintage style and next we have the same style but this is in the color Prudence I love that name 
if you ever watched uh what show was that called charmed i think it was called charmed and one of the witches in the show was called prue but her full name was prudence and i, I don't know i just always thought that was a pretty name but this is again in the tortoise shell style i just I'm so obsessed with this color of the darker blue, a little bit of light blue, and the black all mixed together. I think it's such a vibe. And this color and style just might be my favorite in this whole haul. I just... I'm really drawn to the aviator look. Next, going back to a super funky frame in my opinion, this is in the style Cousteau and the shade is called Viva. And it's that same beige neutral tones and it's got the tortoise shell style again. It's a bit thicker on here to match the thickness of the sides up here. And this one is cool because it has a straight across bar again to really frame the face. And I think these are so unique because it's very circular and round but then it also adds in that square definition as well so it's like mixing the two together so very fun and unique if you are into this kind of style and being like a little bit more funky with your frames i would say this is for sure a go-to for you and then for the next frame we have the same style of Cousto in the shade vanguard if you couldn't tell the theme of this latest drop with hip optical was kind of beige and blues again always love a good tortoise shell and these are a bit more muted versus the bright beige color so if you like a fun frame like this but you don't want it to be like too much in your face i feel like this color is a very good option and i like the beige but if i had to choose i think the blue would be my favorite i just like how the dark kind of contrasts with my hair personally i love trying out new fun frames like this that i have just never seen before or worn on my face yet next is the style tianu in the shade is called sultry it's more of that muted beige color with the black specks for that tortoise shell kind of style which i always think is so cute these are more of an edgy cat eye like shape i love that the top bar is a little bit extended to give you that more oversized look i love a good larger frame on my face shape i love how these frames appear oversized but the frame around it is still skinny so it's a nice contrast and it complements one another and then we also have this color in the same frame and this is called velvet it is still tortoise shell but it's much darker with the black and it maybe has a little bit of brown some clear through it but mostly you just see the black which i think is really nice i love a darker frame like i said you know to complement my hair and i feel like if you're someone who doesn't like a lot of color these would be a really good option because they are still tortoise shell so it's not looking super flat in one color but they are still muted enough and they mostly appear that black color color and this is a frame I feel like universally will look good on a lot of people. The next frame is in the style Noku and the color is called Sultry. This is an unconventional take on a classic cat eye, much larger. I feel like this is like a butterfly shaped style. I think this is a super cute style if you couldn't tell we love the tortoise shell look over here. I think these are just everything. I don't know, I just really like a good cat eye. My first ever glasses I ever had were a cat eye, but they were super small. So I'm really happy we've expanded to the larger frames like this and just give a more like stylish appearance and a more sophisticated feel. And this color is just giving it to me right now. It's very pretty, I think. And I like how even though they are oversized, you can still see your eyebrows and everything through and like nothing is being blocked at all on your face. I just this is like a really good frame to me that i love so this is probably another one of my favorites in this haul second to the aviator style and we also have the same style in the color shade dawn it's more of the darker frame again with the tortoise shell and then it's a little bit of brown black and gray vibes so that's a really pretty mixture all together so if you just want something a little bit darker this is a very good option again you could not go wrong with a cat eye. I think they're so sophisticated and stunning and just an overall really cool frame. You wanna try some more? Oh, Mr. Perfect. You look great. You look great. You look so perfect. It's unreal how perfect you are. Oh. I'll take them. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, you're sitting right on them. Really? Really? Get off the glass.
glasses. And lastly, we have the style Laga, and the shade is called Sultry. Again, you have the lighter beige tortoiseshell with the black speckles. You can really see more on the side there. And these are perfect if you're into more of the bolder frame versus that dainty style. And I love the stunning square shape. I personally love a square shape over a circle shape if I had to choose. So these are really cool and it gives more of that aviator style that I am super obsessed with. This is also another type of frame that gives that similar vibe. I love how this frame kind of complements both styles of a street style look, but also like office work vibes and then we have that same style but this is in the shade velvet it's more of a moodier vibe with the darker tortoiseshell colors all mixed together with the black a little bit of clear in the brown you can see better on the side here just such a stunning array of colors together and if you want something a little bit more bolder of a frame and a bit bolder of a color, this would be the perfect style for you. I love how this style looks. I think it's very flattering and the square shape is just giving it to me right now. So those are all the frames I had to try on for you today from the brand Hipoptical. I hope you loved watching this little try on haul with all these cute new fun frames over on their website. They have tons more frames to choose from so if you're into more of that basic style they have the looks for you over there but if you like the fun funky frames they definitely have those on the website as well and if you did like any of the frames today that you saw in this video or if you just want to check out their website and see what else they have browse around you can use my code Katie for an additional percentage off your order and I also believe you can get all of these frames in a sunglass style as well so if you need the sunglasses with the prescription or if you just need the prescription or if you just want the frame you can really tailor it to whatever you're needing at the moment and if you did like this style of video please be sure to give it a thumbs up and if you're not already subscribed hit that little subscribe button down below i would so appreciate it to have your support here over on my channel and i will see you in my next video Bye.